Hello everybody, we come back. We tell you in the last video that we will show you how we will use this tablet for controlling the coil system, this one. We will show you now how we will run and using the coil system, this one. This one, this one, it cannot be connected by the pink uh, application, smart home, King Connie. It will use a K box and our uh, software, this one. Now I will show you what it means. The K32 call, it's only allowed to take inputs, alarms, 16 inputs. We can control the 16 input by the King Kony software. For an example, if we have one of the input, for an example, I can use input number one in the call. If input number one is on, it will give the smart system actuator, for an example, to open relay number 32. Okay? And also about the uh, analog input, one of the 16, we can use uh, tank level. For an example, if we have low limit or high limit, it will give the relay to open or close. This is the situation for the call. Also, we have five sensors of temperature. If the temperature is coming high, we can program it to relay number 10 to be normally open or normally closed. We can also make it off for the AC unit, but it, uh, our program is not powered by this something. The temperatures, sensors, and the uh, analog input and the digital input, they are now for the client is spare, but now it's ready in our system. Now I will show you uh, something. Now this is the, applica the application, okay? Now to we go inside the application, we must make connect. We must first of all put the IP address of the call. We will ser uh, search on it in our router, and then we will put it here. Now we will make connect. Now it's connect, okay? This is the temperatures. They are now not uh, connect. The temperature and the analog also, the analog system here, they are not connect yet. Uh -huh. They are not connect yet. Now I will show you the lamps. Do we know our system is connected? We want to know our system is connected by the PC or no. Now I will make a test. For an example, I will take, for an example, I will turn on relay number one, like this manually handily, relay number one, and relay number three now we must know and now now we must have a lamp in our tablet and now it's really came look you see the color green number one and number three they are now on but this system is not programmed yet. When the client will bring the sensors of the temperatures and the tank levels and everything, just only he will connect it here. Just only he will connect it here. Now look, now everything is a spare. Look, everything now, it's a spare. Only the next step, only he will bring the, only the client, he will bring the materials and they will add it and connect it and it will work surfery. Also, we will program this tablet. If we have low liquid, for an example, uh, low tank of the water or uh, any something, we can know it in our tablet. Also, this panel have circuit diagram. Also, we will add it in the video. 
this one, everything we do it, it's automatically. Look, this is for an example. This is the relay H32 smart relay. It means this one, the H32 smart relay. Look, now we are adding D1, digital input number one. It's connected by RB, relay 32. So it will give us the relay coil contact and it will give us an alarm in our mobile. For an example, this is another page. I open it uh, handily. This is the circuit of the contactors. It means that the circuit of these contactors, they are connected by RB1. It means the relay of the PLC system. The, also we can do, sorry. We can, uh, RB number one, this is the relay of the PLC. The smart relay will give us the order to the PLC and the PLC will run. Uh, another something I will show you in the smart, okay, yes, yes, now we will run our system manually, just a moment, stop, uh -huh. yes, now Now the manual run is working on. It will give us in the last video. Now it will work manually. Now it will work manually. And it will also give us a message in our mobile that it's running manually. About the AC unit, I will show you the kind of the AC unit. Look, this American standard, it's an old kind of ACs. We cannot connect it. Also, this is the heater we can use. The temperature for it, it will give us the reading in our system in the PC tablet. We can know the temperature by the analog about what is the temperature of our heaters or what is the temperature of our AC unit, uh, our zone. And also we can know everything by this system. This is our uh, system. Now I will show you something. We can also make in our uh, application there is an option, it is all on and all off. Without, I am using the PLC system. The smart King Connie, it will make this option. Now, I will try it in my mobile. Look friends, all on this one. Now I will make it all off. Now you will see one by one. One by one. One by one. One by one. Also, we can use another option. We can use it also all on. When I will press all on. will also run one by one, one by one. That's about this panel. We explain for you about it. And it's a huge uh, panel, but it's very, very uh, simple and very, very nice. And also energy saving. Thank you very much for watching this video and see you in another project soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.